enemies now, the bell ring. <laughs> Have you had that situation before? I didn't want to stop him, and I didn't want to knock, knock him out. So sometimes it can make a difference. Trunks. Joseph Diaz in the lime green trunks. He gave the ultimate surprise to Delgado in knocking him out in the third round. And you do 130 pounds. He fought 126 for a large part of part of not have the speed or the explosiveness that they do at 126, but they definitely have more last gas for his career. He admits that he did not. But the preparation of Charles Huerta is impeccable. You can tell. He, uh, I am. I, <laughs> maybe now after Hating eating a couple burgers. Over the hand right from that about his father. So he's not only fighting for himself, he's fighting for his father as well. He had an injury or he just couldn't get fights. But now he's decided to go 100% into his boxing career. And see. Nice left hand there from Jojo Diaz. As Huerta came with a... If Charles Huerta... Oh, nice work on the body from Diaz. Charles flex away. Charles. Diaz, an action fighter, great body puncher. And big one from Diaz. And keep in mind, it was because he dove in. He was, Diaz is a great counter puncher. And, even, and even, if he could just time. Diaz and Charles Huerta. Where to come back, in and just back. looking for the counter punch, and it seems to be working for him because Charles Huerta is only looking to the line green. And they both have their defense pretty high. Might bring him to fight in the box. And now a left hand oh. to the body. And a right hand by Huerta. But the cleaner punches would have stuck that jab through the mist. It's very up. Sort of what we're seeing here. Exactly. But the thing with Joseph Diaz is that if he continues, you know, just in time for them not to get hit. So he needs to throw more punches, be more active. Adrian Estrella, that was. Fifth round of a Schedule 10 at Super Featherweight. Jojo Diaz. Taking a look at the punches through three rounds, according to CompuBox. Charles Huerta's father and corner told him to do. Armando Huerta told him to begin. So, an added audience for Charles Huerta. And the left-handed uppercut. Worked for him. Nice combination there from Huerta. It's his corner of ball. Powerful exchange there. Diaz trying to go to the uppercut. Strong right. Right hand lands on the body again from Diaz. Tell me, Ryan, do they look knowing how to switch on and off the aggressive button? Oh, good uppercut. Eddie Hernandez Sr. says look out for the head to JoJo. It's correct. I mean, listen, Charles Huerta and Joseph Diaz have been doing this for years, and they've set to knowing that he's coming to win, you know, in a spectacular way, you know, just automatically. Left hand to the body from Diaz. How many jabs have landed? Well, maybe six now, because I saw one land by, <laughs> by Joseph Diaz, but definitely, I mean, jab, a jab is after upsetting previously unbeaten Ivan fight, Delgado man. in 2017. He has landed his power punches with great precision thus far tonight. The land punches on Joseph Diaz. Now the combination from Diaz. Puerta clearly feeling those blows from Diaz. Have to in order to try and finish this fight early. Especially since he hurt him the last. A great job of leaning to his left, staying out of the, the distance of Charles Huerta, trying not to get here. Good right hand. Good hook right through the temple, you know, and that's what's happening now. If Charles Huerta would throw the jab, that would make way with those big right hooks, left hooks. Without an Asian there. He's always had that. I've known Charles Huerta since, out, since we were 14, 13 years old. We'd see each other. It's a good test for him. He definitely needs to stay more focused. He needs to stay determined. Diaz hits the body with a left hand, and then a left hand up top. Is Asians, his straight left, and will possibly may open up other opportunities as him throwing the jab, him, you know, well on the seventh round. Diaz had Huerta hurt, but with that last round, 69 landed to Huerta's three. Seems to be landing most of his punches. So he's trying to knock Huerta out. He has just hasn't landed the punch that takes him. He'll grab a beer after the fight. He'll grab a beer after the fight. 
Exactly. He needs to be willing to make bigger sacrifices stop, stop in his punches, career. That way he continues to elevate his... Chano will both be defending their respective titles. 30 seconds. Hunt. That's what that means in Spanish. He's, he's on the hunt. He's trying to look for that big shot that will take... Jojo Diaz and Charles Huerta. Jojo between rounds. I said, why'd you give him life? I mean, he's not tired. I told him, he let, he'd give him life. He slacked it, slowed down because he's feeling comfortable, and that's what you don't want to do. And that was, that's what he needs to change. He needs to stay performing at the highest. By Huerta, then a left hook from Huerta. Now he became more of a brawl. They're both fighting on the inside. He's pushing forward when it comes to Huerta. And Joseph is doing the same thing. He, he's... We have two yes. more fights put up at great performance, trying to become the WBC world champion and nerf to engineer for Boeing. He will tell you there's no financial pressure for him to box. He just wanted to had an impressive first round. It's been all JoJo. Yeah, I agree. JoJo Diaz, okay. as he's told by Ed Hernandez Sr. Good combination by Joseph Diaz. He changed it up. He's, he's not loading up with one punch, but he's coming. From each fighter exchange. Close quarters here. Knowing that no if punches. it goes to points, it's going to go Jojo Diaz's way. He should be able to come out with the victory. Diaz Stop. landed the left no hand punch, to the no body. Where the hangs in? Right hand landed from. Another oh. stiff left hand. Final round between these good friends, Jojo Diaz and Charles Huerta. Hundred punches and taking Huerta out. Strong right. Joe Diaz puts leaving his hands down as he just gets ready to wind up. You know what? He's not. Left hand to the body from Huerta. Stop. Let him up. Let him up. Let go. Let go. Step back. Step back. Huerta trying to unleash a couple of shots here before time. He has consistently landed big shots throughout the evening to finish things off. Diaz gets away one last draw. Here we go to the judges' scorecards, and all three judges have it the same. 99. As he improves to 28 and 1.